the initial chords happen quite quickly, but uh, then of course it's you know we've I mean I think we've spent about we spent quite a few months kind of shaping it and tweaking it and changing it and trying to find a trying to find something that that retained your interest for you know for the kind of four minutes it lasts you know um, yeah I mean it's it, it's it's obviously like a a song like this has to have has to have uh, a sort of gravity and dynamic rather than it being something that's like an instant an, an instant pop an instant pop song you know and uh, and uh, hopefully it's got lasting value a bit's already out there on the internet uh, what have you made of the reaction yeah for, for the bits i've heard i think i'm 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 quite pleased but i'm i'm i can't wait for people to hear the rest of it because i think uh, like particularly Dell's performance is really jaw dropping and what was it like actually finishing the song in this very studio? What was that feeling like? No, oh, it's, pheno it's phenomenal. I mean, um, you know, watch, you know, watching the, the sort of result of this of this sort of, uh, of a period of labour come to fruition, and especially with uh, you know having having sort of demoed the sort of orchestral side of things, and then uh, and then had someone orchestrate it, and then and then to actually see it performed was. Uh, Oh, it was quite a moment, really, and especially like you know to see to finally see a few people's reactions to the song. I think was uh, uh, like I think we felt like we'd uh, I think we felt like we nailed it. For you, an incredible twelve months for both you and Thank Adele. You. you know the Grammys, the Brits. You know the biggest selling album in the world. How does getting to do a Bond theme rank amongst all of that? No, oh, so it's a total honour. I mean. I guess it's one of those things that until you actually ask, until you actually ask, until you ask to do it, and the uh, the possibilities put in front of you, you don't really realise what. Well, firstly, what pressure comes with it, and secondly, that um, that how much there's a, there's definitely a degree of pride in you know in 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 being asked, and and but then you've, then you've got to deliver, and uh, and I guess you just have to try and switch off from the uh, from the pressure and try and just do something that's. Uh, that's true to the artist you're working with, and true to the nature of the film uh, and the story. And I think that you know the best Bond, Bond songs feel like they're part of the film. You know, they're like a, they sort of they 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 they're part of the story and the part of the narrative of the film. People are already talking about this as a, a potential Grammy winner, as a possible Oscar winner. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know about that. I don't want to get into <laughs> speculation. <laughs> And for you, how difficult has it been keeping this uh, secret? You know, we've been talking about this for so long. People saying it's got to be Adele and Paul Letworth for this. Yeah, I mean, it's you know, it's, I'm, I'm often surprised that things don't leak out quicker. Um, but this is this has definitely been a, a kind of a, a sort of a MI6 like subterfuge to try and uh, to try and keep it under wraps. And uh, I think uh, you know, I'm just eager to see when when people finally hear the full track and this and, and her vocal performance. And uh, I think I'm, I'm looking forward to seeing what people think, you know, people really make of it, you know.